Hey there, ladies and gentlemen, it's me, Dr. Donna. I'm sitting down getting ready to read the book Priceless for my 52 book challenge. This is what I found inside of the book. It is the receipt for the book and the book is old because you guys know I go to the library to get my books. So this book was purchased and wait for it, 2003. So the receipt was placed on page 15 and the person I bought the book so many years ago never even read it. They didn't even crack the spine and wait for it. They bought it in California and now the book is in a library in Las Vegas. Hmm. So what's my point, ladies and gentlemen? How many books have you bought and haven't read? You hear it all the time. I've said it before. All Everybody's always talking about they're a bestseller, they're a bestseller. But is your book a best reader? Hmm. With my book challenge, and I'm about to enter into the fifth year going into November, I went back and every book that I half-assed read or half-assed started and didn't finish, guess what, ladies and gentlemen? I have read all of them except for one. It's also the reason why I only wrote one book, because if I'm not about to be writing a whole bunch of books that people buying and ain't nobody reading, doggone it, what I say, you better do, because that's going to change your life. You understand what I'm saying? Real Leaders Wear Pink is all the book you ever going to get out of me, okay? In summary, quit wasting your money on books that you know you ain't going to read, and read the books that you already got before you go buy any more books. And quit reading all this damn nonfiction. Nonfiction ain't going to get your life in check. Better start reading some stuff that's actually going to make a damn difference. And back to our regularly scheduled program, okay?